Are we talking about as good as, wild, or better? I I'd say better. It's You've got a big pair of cojones, you know that? A big pair of cojones. Huh? <laughs> yes, I have. Fuck me. <laughs> First, Keith's taking me to see the tiddlers. They're so ugly. Yeah. <laughs> and yet so delicious and delicate. Yeah. But it'll be eight years before we can tell the little boys from the big money girls, who can be anything up to the age of 20 before their caviar's ready for harvesting. Oh, God, they're everywhere. But first, I've got to catch one. If you can, grab the head. <laughs> Prehistoric distant relatives of the shark, these big mothers are almost 60 kilos, and to be examined for caviar, they're wrestled out of the water by hand. Okay. Let's get on. It's absolutely beautiful. So how old is this one? This one will probably be between 18, 19 years old. For nearly half that time, the valuable eggs in this fish have been developing. Their size and condition are checked using ultrasound. You can just about see every single egg. I mean, it's honestly identical to going with your wife for an ultrasound, little KY jelly, robbing round, <laughs> looking for the little heartbeat, and oh shit, there's two heartbeats there, you've got twins. Except here we're looking at what, four and a half to five kilos, kilos of, of caviar. caviar. The trick is to catch the eggs at their optimum quality before the fish spawns naturally. But this beauty isn't quite ready yet. Possibly six months, really? we'll, we'll give it another, another, another scan right. uh, and see how it's getting on. If we just try and turn it around. Yeah, my okay. God. Oh, shit. OK. There we go. And then just slowly push it off, just, just very, very calmly. When the sturgeon are ready, they're killed and sent for a clinical extraction. This looks like a fucking operating theatre. Hola. Hola. Today, Chief Sturgeon Surgeon Javier is entrusting me with a scalpel. Is that too deep? No, 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 no keep going, keep going. That's good, just keep going. A little bit. Yeah, that's perfect, then... keep going. OK, let me see it. Oh, shit, I can see caviar. Yeah, it starts very far down. Well, I wish you'd told me. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Look at all that caviar in there. Look at that. Is that all the way up there? Mm. My God. OK, so you can actually see... Look at that. Jesus Christ. You can see the amount of eggs there. Look okay. at all the caviar. <laughs> it's like a bathtub full of fucking caviar. How much is in there? I'm surprised you haven't got a security guard for each sturgeon in there. You know that? <laughs> yeah, we do. Underwater diver. <laughs> we, do. we don't we have do. security guards, but we have big dogs. Do you mind if a little taste, please? No, go ahead. Unbelievable. It does need some salt on there. In terms of flavour. Fucking hell. It's extraordinary. It's like a treasure. I couldn't wait to learn how to transform these freshly harvested eggs into the delicacy I know and love. So, shall we process? Process? Yeah. Fuck process. me. I'm going back home. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Fuck that. First, the eggs are separated from the membrane. Right. So, you're just gently rubbing it, holding the membrane. And we're not bursting the eggs like this. No. That is beautiful. What's that worth in there now, Keith? Talking well over £10,000. Oh, my God. They're then rinsed in cold, salted spring water... <laughs> ..before sea salt is added to dramatically enhance the caviar's flavour. You do. I don't want to fuck up. No, £10,000 worth of fucking caviar. OK. Fingers in and just last right? Yeah. Faster. Faster. OK. Oh. Very creamy. For me, it doesn't need any more salt. That's delicious. Yeah. Seasoned to perfection and matured for four months, the caviar in this tin alone will be worth three and a half grand. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Pretty good. Thank Gracias. You. This stuff really does give wild caviar a run for it.